I'm going to let C be the total cost of the peak rate cost. That means C is going to be equal to 0.12x. That means the expectation of C is going to be the expectation of this, which is 0.12, the expectation of X. So this is 0.12, expectation of X is 180. This is equal to 21.6. And for the variance of C is the variance of this, it is 0.12 square, the variance of X. So this is 0.12 square, variance of x is 30 square. This is 12.96, which means that C is going to follow a normal distribution of 21.6 and 12.96. And what the question is actually looking at is two independent instances of C, which means that we are looking at C1 plus C2. Let's find the expectation of this. This is the same as the expectation of C, plus the expectation of C. So it is 2 times the expectation of C. It is 2 times 21.6. The expectation of C1 plus C2 is 43.2. And I also want to find what is the variance of C1 plus C2. This is the variance of C1, which is C, plus the variance of C2, which is also C. So it is 2 times the variance of C, which is 2 times of 12.96 and this is equal to 25.92 which means that C1 plus C2 is going to follow a normal distribution of 43.2 and 25.92 and what the question one is the probability that C1 plus C2 is going to be greater than 45 and if I were to press this into my calculator, again using this as the normal distribution, the probability is 0 0.362.